Okay, so I wanted to do a case study example of Nice here where I want to talk about negative self-talk and not negative self-talk in the way that you criticize yourself, but in the way that you talk about the game, and the discussion you have with yourself about the game as you're playing. And let's look at this situation first. Tries to invade the raptors here. Enemy support twitch here. So it misses the bubble. Now this looks rough, right? You just need to leave. Twitch is gonna just zone you off. He does leave. He can quite let go of it. And he gets pulled down. Gets the crab and then gets out. Okay. Fast forward. Zoe, you cannot be serious. You had exhaust up. Use your exhaust and stop pinging me, you fucking child. I fucking hate these kids so much. He lets a level 2 twitch zone me off of fucking counter jungling. And then he holds his exhaust and pings me like he isn't shit at the game. Now, some people may view like this kind of thing as harmless venting. But I think it's harmful venting. I think it ultimately just trickles down into... The rest of your review process or your process or your just approach towards the game i think it's negative i think you want to avoid this and there's a few things that i don't like about this he also says she's shit at the game now this is his teammate he has played more than 200 ranked games he has 50 or negative percent win rate and he is, deserves to be in this elo and so does the Zoe he's playing with. But he just views her as shit. I think that in itself is just negative, right? Because you view, you look at yourself as a victim that's not supposed to be here with these monkeys. And that will hold you back. You won't improve as fast if that's your mindset. Now, I think when Zoe misses the bubble, you should just adapt and leave. And mute pings. Don't talk shit. Just mute pings if you think they're annoying. Okay. So he looks to invade the enemy jungle here. Thanks to Grom. Comes in. Spots the Shinja. Goes in. Shinja flashes out and then he uh, dies. Like, why are you refusing to help me? I don't understand. Why are you refusing to help me? I don't understand. Okay, let's look at this. Look at his bot lane here, guys. His bot lane is here. They cannot help him. They can't walk through the tower. They have no wave. They can't walk through here. They can't even walk through here and flash over the wall and help him in time. They cannot help him. This is on him. He misread the situation. He misread the map state. And he had to leave here. It's on him. But he immediately shifts the focus from himself to his teammates. Like, why are you refusing to help me? Why I don't are understand. they refusing to help me? When they even couldn't have. Good. It's fine to be confused about a situation. What you should do is go back to the replay after the game. Look it over. And then you can uh, sort it out. It's like they're deliberately like not helping. It's like they're deliberately not helping. See, just this talk, like he's he's uh, creating all these narratives that he's a victim and that they're just out there to fuck with him, that they're deliberately fucking him over, all of them. I think it's so bad. It's so bad. It just, it shifts your focus. It distracts you from what you could have done and your improvement. That's my Jace running it down. And there we go. Jace dies. Why is my Jace running it down? 
So we've looked at this replay now for three minutes and he has flamed his entire team. That is what I'm talking about. This way he's talking about the game is so bad, I think. It is literally holding him back from improving. He should just look at that top and say, Oh, my Jace died. This changes the puzzle that I need to solve in order to win the game. And you could also look at it in the way of how could I have contributed to the situation top? Could I have, have stopped Jace from dying or could I have avoided Jace from dying? And if you could not have, then you drop it, you leave it, you ignore it. It's out of your control. It's noise. So this is what I wanted to talk about. I think this holds him back 